A Serge Aurier header, a fantastic finish by Harry Kane and probably the goal of the season from Tottenham midfielder Tongyon Dombele. Simply unbelievable. Sheffield United 1, Tottenham Hotspur 3. Welcome back to another video. I hope you're all keeping safe and well. So the full-time whistle has just gone. Sheffield United 1, Tottenham Hotspur 3. Deserved, comfortable, in control, professional, clinical. And what a superb finish. A superb goal from Tongi Ondombele. And that is what this game will be remembered for. Tongi Ondombele's goal. What a finish. His vision, his technique, the finish. It was just unbelievable. That will probably be the Premier League goal of this season. Of course, in the first half, Tottenham got off to a great start. Um, Serge Aurier's header from a uh, Hunmin Son corner. A wonderful corner uh, whipped in. Serge Aurier finishing. And then, of course, Harry Kane um, in the 40th minute made it 2-0. Great work from Pierre-Emile Hoybier. Harry Kane uh, shot from range, put it into the bottom right-hand corner. 2-0. It was half-time 2-0. And, uh, and then, of course, Tongyon Dombele in the 62nd minute made it 3-1 to Spurs. Um, a couple of minutes before, McGoldrick uh, put Sheffield United back into the game at 2-1. Um, but in the 62nd minute, and I'm, I'm not going to talk about Sheffield United's goal. It's not worth it because the quality of this goal from Tongyon Dombele was just simply incredible. It is a goal that I will be watching again and again and again tonight because the finish, the finish was just unbelievable. I know a lot of us Tottenham fans have given Tongyon Dombele stick, particularly um, you know last season. It was his first season at the club, and you know many of us thought that you know it'd be best that he went out the door and was sold, and uh, he has turned it around. He really, really has, and it proves that you know if if you're if you're not starting under Jose Mourinho and you're not you know you're not getting much game time, you know Tongyon Dombele is proof that you can turn it around and you know get back into the team and become one of those first starters, those first people on the team sheet. And Tongyon Dombele is certainly doing that. But the finish, I, I can't talk about it enough because it was absolutely unbelievable. Um, Stephen Bergvine. Um, knocked the ball over. Tongyon Dombele, um, you know, latched onto it. Ramsdale, uh, you know, was nowhere to be seen, you know, because the outside of his foot, Tongyon Dombele, the outside of his foot, uh, putting it into the bottom right-hand corner. It was just an unbelievable finish. And as I say, that that will be uh, what this game is uh, is remembered for, the Tongyon Dombele goal. Um, anyway, it was a really good performance today by Tottenham, a very, very professional performance. Tottenham were in control from the very, very first minute. I know Sheffield United got their goal, but Tottenham ultimately were in control. We played good attacking football. Um, the first 10 minutes or so, Tottenham, Probably should have been 2-0 up because, of course, Hun Min Son had that, uh, had that chance to hit the post. Um, but we wanted to see good attacking football today. We certainly got that. I felt that Tottenham in the first half certainly defended very, very well, particularly just before the first half whistle went in the 43rd minute. Um, you know, two great blocks from Roden and Eric Dyer, and I thought that Roden done very well uh, defensively, uh, you know, for Tottenham today. Um, the only thing that surprised me uh, today, no Deli Ali in the squad, no Deli Ali uh, as a sub. Uh, of course, Gareth Bale, um, you know, travelled up to Bramall Lane today. He didn't even get a minute of Premier League football. Carlos Vinicius uh, barely got one or two minutes. Um, he came on in the 92nd minute. Um, you know, no Harry Winks today, no uh, Matt Doherty in the squad either today. But overall, I think he's absolutely brilliant that Tottenham got the three points. Jose Mourinho certainly got his reaction. Tottenham are back into the top four. There are so many positives today. And Tottenham are now only three points behind league leaders Manchester United. Just looking at the match stats here, uh, Sheffield United had 42% possession to Tottenham's 58. Sheffield United had 15 shots to Tottenham's 14. Uh, Sheffield United had five shots on target to Tottenham's five. And they had five corners to Tottenham's seven. Tottenham's next Premier League game will be at home to Liverpool, but before that, we will be playing in the FA Cup against Wickham Wanderers away. They will be two interesting games. 
Please do let me know all of your thoughts in the comments section below. What did you make of today's game? Can Tottenham challenge for the Premier League or can Tottenham get that top four place at the end of this season? Let me know all of your thoughts in the comments section below. But I'm certainly smiling tonight. I hope you are too. Enjoy the rest of your weekend. I'll see you on the next video. Remember, the trophies are coming. Until the next video, come on, you Spurs.